The U.S. oil company Chevron has been forced to shut down operations in the Niger Delta region of that country after protesters cut off access to its storage facility. Now, the protests have been going on for at least the last week at Chevron's Escravo's oil storage tank farm. Here's Kelechi Mekalam with more. The youth laid siege at the facility from Tuesday last week and prevented movements in and out. Although organizers claimed the protest would be peaceful, angry demonstrators, mostly unemployed youth, set bonfires close to the facilities boldly marked flammable. Chevron has already airlifted its staff from the facility. Without providing much details, the company said it was in talks with the youth leaders responsible for the protests. Years of oil spills in the Delta region has left the environment there largely polluted, and the communities in the region complain they have not benefited from Nigeria's vast oil wealth even though they sit on it. Chevron is the third largest oil company producing over 200,000 barrels of crude oil and some 6,000 liquefied petroleum gas. The company is also a major supplier of gas for electricity generation for the national power grid. But like any other oil company, it has been a target for militant attacks. Just last week, militants blew up its oil pipeline in the region. The state-owned oil company, NNPC, has already admitted militancy in the region has cut exports by some 700,000 barrels and continued unrest could hurt Nigeria even more. Kelechi Mekalam, CCTV Abuja, Nigeria.